Hello there guys, welcome, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Uh, if you're new here, my name is Yvonne Candy. Welcome to my channel. I would be interested to have you as part of the family. So hit that subscribe button. I do a lot of home decor, home organizing, cooking, just anything to do with home. So yeah, and today's video now is more of a continuation of last week's video, which was a part two of my kitchen makeover. And uh, today now I'm doing a spice organizing video. Spices have been one thing that I've always wanted to organize in my kitchen and now I'm happy that I'm able to share this with you. So keep watching the video. So I have these spice bottles that I got from Amazon and they are 14, uh, uh, 14 in number and one thing that has been hard for me this year is finding spice bottles in Nairobi. If you love cooking, that means you, you have spices. And if you have spices, I'm sure you've been in search for spice bottles around Nairobi and it's hard to get any uh, in Nairobi. But there's some that I saw in House of Leather, but they have a, a round shape. So I was not interested in those, but maybe if you'd like, you can go and check out House of Leather. So I got this from Amazon and they are 14. I got them for $17 and the good thing is I had a friend out of the country so I shipped them to her so I avoided paying a lot of shipping fees uh, to bring them in Kenya. So maybe if you have a friend over there you can always take advantage of that and you can always bring them for you. And now the thing I loved about these spice bottles as I've said they are 14 and the good thing is they come with labels. There are a bunch of labels in here and these two are labels and at least now when I put my spices in the bottles I can I, I can label them because it can be hard for you to know which spices which or if you have a friend over and they want to cook it can be hard for them to know which spices which so they have labels which is a good thing and again they have this funnel uh, that I'm going to use to pour in my spices. So now let me get started with organizing. This is how actually the spice bottles look. They are perfect size to hold your spices. And I love the shape that it comes with uh, because I will be able now to arrange the spices well. And that reminds me, I've not shown you how I organize my spices. So I store my spices in this drawer cabinet over here. And there's actually nothing wrong with this cabinet as it is because it's well organized. What I'm doing now is more of an upgrade. Now, maybe this method would work for someone who was uh, wondering how to arrange and uh, to organize the spices. This is one method that works so, uh, so well for me. I just lay them over here with the labels facing up ones. Then at the back of this, uh, cabinet I have my dish cloths the ones that I'm not using at the back so what I'm doing I'll be transferring the spices from here to the spice bottles so let me clear out the cabinet And at the bottom, I had this tiburana, like uh, this, the same piece that I used for my, for the drawer that holds my marks. So, yeah. So I have these two types of labels to choose from, and I think I will go with this type. So let's see how many they have in here. Actually, it says no. Yeah, there are a lot uh, now I have everything transferred uh, in the jars I have all my spices over here uh, I've already put on the labels it was easy to install them I uh, just peel and stick so yes it's all beautiful now what I'm going to do is put everything back in the cabinet of course I'm going to start with my foils I like to put them uh, in this drawer because I use them to cook anyway so and they don't have any other place I don't have any other place to store them so I prefer putting them uh, right here and 
then uh, at the back I'm going to put my dish clothes that I'm not using so they will go so they will go at the back and now I can arrange the spices and uh, this is what I was talking about the shapes uh, uh, of these bottles I love them because I can easily place them down and they're not going to like roll over my curry powder because I don't mind the, the bottle that it comes with so yeah and then uh, for the labels I put them at the back the rest of the labels I put them at the back and now this is my spice uh, drawer I'm happy with how it looks like this are one of those investments you make and you're happy with it so I love it it looks beautiful it looks neat and most importantly and most importantly it looks organized so yeah i'm happy with it and maybe if there's someone who knows uh where to buy spice bottles in nairobi you can leave a comment uh, a comment in the comment section and at least you can be able to help someone else wow today has been one of those longest days for me because i've been able to do Two videos but uh, I'm happy with how everything has turned out and at least now I think I'm done with my kitchen which means I will start now doing my bedroom which I will start sharing with you very very soon I don't want to promise on the date or anything but very very soon so subscribe and stay tuned for that uh, if you have enjoyed today's video as usual give the video a thumbs up if you just watched me for the first time don't forget to subscribe uh, share 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 so yeah, so guys, I'm going to see you on my next one. Bye.